All right, guys, as you can see, we're back here in the guts of our system. I've gone ahead and cleaned it up back here quite a bit. As you can see, we are using 30 channels for this one. You guys haven't seen this one before. Um, but anyway, I've also put a crafting terminal. And before I forget, let's go look at what the uh, lime one is. It's going down there. Oh, yeah, and I put string there. So now we have lots of string. So if we go downstairs... Oh, look, looks the same. Wow, it looks so much different. Guys, look at all these processing... So we're going to call these servers, because they look like servers. Uh, but I've got all these set up, and I also put the iron plates up at the top, because I think it looks weird and interesting. But yeah, so we, every single one of these is connected up, guys. And this gives us so much potential for crafting. But I have to go ahead and um, put all of the speed upgrades in here, so our system is very quick. And as you can see, that's where it comes in. And then we have a green one running along here, and it ends here, and then this one actually branches around to this way and goes forward. So pretty cool. Haven't done a whole lot off camera. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but we got our fluids automated. I've got these all upgraded to resonant. Um, it's funny, resonant ender is in there. Uh, but basically, we have a magma crucible, and I just have an export pus, export bus, uh, dump an end stone, resonant end stone into here, so it fills up this buff bus, and then it. Um, fills up this tank so I can see what's in there and then it fills this up and whatever we put in here like buckets and stuff like that that's pretty much the same for all this except for the uh, cryothium it's a little bit more difficult because we have to automatic we have to craft it ourselves and then it fills it up but we do have a lot in here so nothing to worry about I'll show you the guts back behind here oh and we also got induction smelters each of these have been automated and this is where I've been going to make my prismarine for the past few things um, oh look at that 1480 cacti, sweet. So I keep my dragon egg and then my dragon egg mill. Um, so yeah, pretty simple guys. Um, nothing too crazy. Every single machine I have though, I have upgraded to resonant. And then this is our automatic uh, doubling uh, kit for these materials because these just give the items you don't have to smelt them or anything like that. So that's what I've been up to, guys. What have you been up to? Leave it down in the comments. I'd like to know if you guys are having fun, if you guys are having a good time in the world, if you guys are being crafty crafters. So it appears we've got a bit of a clog in our system, guys. Um, as you can see, I'm picking up nether stars while I'm in here. Um, let's have a look. Yep. But the problem is, oh, well, why is this full? Oh, I forgot to put it back. We need to put it back. Code red. Code red. All right, so we're going to set this up right here. Um, hold up. Those channels are all taken. We're just going to we'll probably have to, have to just put it up here. But anyways, this is how we're going to do it. Um, if you guys didn't know or, or if you're new to the series, uh, we do have a chest here. As you can see, all of our items are back in here. And this is all of the items for both of our um, void miners. And for our withers. Um, so we'll just throw the speed upgrades in there for now. And then I need to grab some cables. Like so. And then we're going to throw these here. Here. And would this work? That should work. Let's see. Oh, yeah. That's working great. Um, it's going to need to catch up. Uh, there it goes. It's going to catch up right now. So sweet, guys. That is all crack a lack and now as you can see all of our items are being pumped into there. Let's see. Yeah, don't make me a liar. <laughs> so what we've got over here, guys, if you are new to the series, we've got a level two um a level two void miner. And then over here we've got a level three. Now we're gonna need to move these eventually because I hate this look. I thought we were gonna use this for that, but Turns out, probably not going to be able to. Uh, so we're going to end up putting something else here. I think we might put a little Batania station there. I think that might be pretty cool. But we're going to need to move this down below. And I think I've got a pretty cool idea. All right, guys. So I got what I wanted set up. So let's go check out the new Void Miner area. Boom. It's going to be on down here, everyone. Let's grab all of these. I don't know what these things are. It's probably the Flux stuff. But over here is not... Oh, look at that. Wow, incredible. But this is where we're going to be putting our void miners, guys. It's about to get really dark. Um, so we'll see about getting some light down here, maybe even expanding the um, my division thing to all the way down here. See, it's pretty dark. So I'm going to head back on up. We're going to see about moving them right now. All right, guys, so we're going to see about actually upgrading to Tier 4 while we're here. We should have enough. So let's see how it goes. So Tier 3, Tier 3 frames. Yep. 
Okay, perfect. So we don't need all of that. We're gonna need some more structure panels. So let's make sure we craft these bad boys up. All right, and then go here. Perfect. Now we're gonna need to look into the nullifiers, or the modifiers, sorry. <laughs> Not nullifier. Okay, so we're gonna make another speed upgrade because that's what we feel like doing because we lack like speed. But these tier four guys, these tier four ones are like crazy from what I've heard. And then I guess there's, a, there's another level above that. There's a level beyond the Super Saiyan. What? Yeah, crazy. It's got me all discombobulated. Hold up. Where's my concrete? Black concrete. You're supposed to be used for things. Oh, I need to make more of these. Okay, we got enough. Don't worry, guys. We have a stupid amount of stuff. What the heck? What the heck? Oh, we gotta make these interconnects. Okay. Okay, so these all use the null modifier, so we don't have to worry about that. Perfect. All right, now let's make an accuracy modifier. What is the bottom? Is that diamond? Block of diamond? What's going on, diamond? You're at 13,000. You should be just fine. All right. Perfect. And then, I don't know what the piezo is. Oh, we can't make it. Oh, we're at a Mika. Mika. no. Okay. So let's go on down to the bottom. All right. We're going to place this one right here. I know it's not centered. Don't freak out. It makes me freak out, but you better not freak out. And I forgot to make a tier four. Hold up. we got to turn this into a tier four. No. What's going on, guys? I don't know. Maybe we need some of this. Boom. And then... And then we make the tier four. Um, just type in three. Nope. Aha! Found him. Okay, so the uses for this guy is this. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. That's not where we want to go. Okay. All right, this is where we want to go. Okay, so tier four. Put you way up here. All right, and then we're going to break all of you. Hold you down. Vein mine it, baby. Let me stop building. It's going to get real dark here real quick. Can we do it before? Oh, I think we got it, though. Yep. Would you? Oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. We need some more of that. I don't know what it is. We're going to make both of them. Okay, so let's go. So we need the, um, just pull up the pack. All right, so we're going to make a lens. We need a clear lens. Where is you? There we go. <gasps> we need more glass? What's using up all that glass? No matter, we can make the other thing while we wait. This bad boy here. Oops. One of these. And where are you at again? Here, right here. One, oh, we need one more. Boom. Okay. Now let's go see if that is all we need to make everything in our dreams. Yep, I think so. I think so. Would you look at it? Would you just look at it? All right, you're getting power. Perfect. And then let's grab some items out of you. Let's see. It's pretty quick, not going to lie. I don't know what we're going to use with all that stuff. Whoa. Whoa. That's a big thing. That's interesting. Very interesting. So it looks like each of these use one of the clear lens. And you swap out the lenses for the different stuff. So I think that's pretty cool. Yep. Four million RF is stored there. Let's see how it's moving. It's pretty quick. 
We're getting lots of resources, but I want it to be faster. So we will worry about that some other time. We got things to do today. All right. Let's get back on up to the top, and let's make our way over to the Batania base. Let's see how we're doing. I haven't been back since last episode. Okay. How much mana we got? How much mana? That's not even a lot of mana. What happened? What happened? Um, so let's go here. We need our book. We need our wand, first off. So we can see what's going on. Okay. Okay, we got a bit of mana. We got a bit of mana. It's actually not as bad as I thought it was. Let's go up here and let's craft up. We need some living rock. Okay, we're going to make up another one of these bad boys. And we're going to throw it in. We're going to see if this works. Do we have enough mana for this? No, we do not. <laughs> what? Where did our flowers go? No! What the heck? They're gone. Hide your Gigans. What? Aw, oh, man. Where'd they go? It doesn't make any sense. No! Aw, oh, man. All right. Guess we'll have to remake them. I don't know why they would just disappear like that. that. Doesn't make any sense. I didn't do anything. I haven't been here, unless someone, someone was here. Uh, let's look up and see how if we have any flowers. No, nope, we don't. I gotta go find some more blue ones. I'll be back, guys. All right, guys. We're gonna see about making the horn of the wild here, so we don't have to keep looking everywhere for everything. So if we throw that in there, it was just grass that we grabbed with shears. We get this pasture seed. I believe if you combine this with living wood, let's see here, and I believe it's something like this, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we get the Horn of the Wild. Now, if this works, as I remember it, we should just be able to go like this. Huh. What does this do again, exactly? Oh, it mines. Oh, okay, interesting, what do you do? I don't know what you do. Hmm, so I guess we're gonna, if, okay, oh, 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 I remember how AZ set it up. Okay, so this is who I'm basing it off of, guys. AZ got this, uh, AZ's a lot more experienced in Batania, so we're gonna see if we can follow what he did. I made a lot of tier four structure panels, that's for sure. Okay, so we don't need that. Um... Don't need that or that. So we need to make the fertilizer. Let's see if we can make any. And I believe he had this automated, if I'm not mistaken. So to make this, yeah. Let's get our flowers. What do we have a lot of that we're not going to need? I haven't needed lime yet. Oh, hold up. Hold the phone. What is going on here? Oh, wait. Maybe we have to, maybe we have to do that. And then we go like this. That's how you do it. Okay. Now we'll see about making the fertilizer. Perfect. All right, so let's see here. Oh, yeah. Would you oh, would you just look at that? And that's how he did it. He just grabbed them all. Just scooped them right up into himself and he was just like, "Yeah, we're done, fools." So we're going to see about um, automating that next episode, but we're not going to do it today. Um, let's see here. I don't think we're actually going to do that much more Batania today, guys. I wasn't expecting my flowers to be gone. So that kind of makes me aggravated. So let me see what we're going to do, all right? Give me one sec. All right, guys, so I figured that for the rest of the episode, we could get our uh, wyvern uh, armor upgraded to the draconium stuff. And so I've gone ahead and done that now. Um, so what we need to upgrade each of the draconium stuff is we need two draconium ingots and then f uh, and then one of these and one of those. Um, sorry, I'm, I'm crafting in the fours, so it's, a, it's throwing me off a little bit. So let's see here. Let's go to... Yep, these all finished crafting up. Perfect. So we should be able to craft up all of these now. So let's see again. Let's just make sure we have it balanced. Okay, so these go on the same side. We'll put these here, put these here. And then we'll go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, so we'll upgrade each of our gear. Perfect. 
So here we go for the helmet. How much power is this going to take? Ah, oh, that'll be quick. But we're going to get the draconic stuff. And the helmet looks kind of funky, not going to lie. So let's see here. All right, it's crafting up perfect. And it does look like the items are gone, but they're still there. Don't worry. Don't worry, guys. Boom. All right, we got that one. Let's take all of our gear off. And so we got that. Let's throw our chest plate in there. That'll charge up pretty quick. Uh, that, these things charge up fast. They take like no power. However, making one block of draconium takes freaking... Look at all the power it takes. 350 million RF. What kind of crap is that? That's loud. Okay. Chest piece is made. All right. Let's throw this bad boy in there and make the pantalones. Oh, and our <laughs> capacitor is gone. <laughs> All right, so it's crafting up now. Man, these things really craft up quick. It's crazy awesome. I love the crafting animation still. They've really improved it. Okay, and then the boots and pants and boots. Oh, I didn't click it. All right. Crafty, 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 craft it. All right. And let's see here. Let's get some charge in them. All right. Perfect. So oh, geez. We got full draconium armor. Why? What happened to night vision? Is it like canceling it out or something? Oop, I can't go up there anymore. What happens if I remove this? Well, okay, let me let me exit the area and come back. This is acting strange since we put our armor on. Oh, guys, so there's a, a configuration you can um, turn on and off night vision. So let's have a look here what our other armor does. Flight speed modifier, huh? Oh my gosh. <gasps> Whoa! Holy cow! Oh my gosh! Oh jeez. Oh, oh jeez. It's so quick. Oh, oh, wow. Oh yeah. Oh jeez. Ah! <laughs> jeez Louise. That is too quick. It's like freaking me out. Holy crap. Let's just go to like 200 for now. That is crazy. And you can hide it. Well, that's cool. Oh, guys, so we can... Oh. Night vision lock. This locks night vision to activate regardless of light level you are in. Okay, I don't care about that. We're just keeping it on. All right, and then pants. Wait, speed modifier. Wait, does this mean we run fast now? Whoa, turbo mode. Hello, everyone. We are super turtle. We are moving quick. This literally makes a super turtle. That's legit. Okay. So we'll just boost it to like 50% because I don't need to be that quick all the time. Okay. And then let's see about the boots. What do you do? Jump modifier? That's cool. Step assist? We'll have it on and then we're going to hide the armor. So we didn't hide it, did we? So we look butt naked, but we're really not. <laughs> and so... Began Super Turtle being the most OP son of a biscuit on the planet. Yeah. Chaos Guardian who? Take me on in my prime. You ain't gonna stop me. You can't even tickle me, right? What's going on? I'm the best. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. But we're gonna wrap up the episode here for today, everyone. I hope you did enjoy. If you did like it, please make sure to like button and don't forget to subscribe. But guys, this has been the Super Turtle, and I'm out. Peace out. Bye-bye.